G'day, welcome back to Truck TV, I'm Gary Worrell. Well, as you can see, we're out on the road again today. This time we're in UD's new MK6 automatic, but with a little bit of a twist. It's been fitted with one of the new tilt tip, tipping and tilting tray back bodies. A very interesting piece of gear, and we'll have a look at that in a little while. The MK6 is a, a very good handling truck. It's really easy to get comfortable in. Plenty of adjustment in the seat. Steering wheel, nice, big, easy to grip. Very clear dash layout. All you've got is a, a speedo, a taco, fuel gauge, temperature gauge, and your air brakes. Really, for a day-to-day -day truck, what more do you need? Your general field of view out the front is good. As I say, I, I do have a little bit of an issue with the, the door mirrors creating some blind spots, but apart from that, there's really nothing wrong with this truck. As you can hear, the cab, very well, the, the, the sound insulation is terrific. The, uh, the engine down underneath us, you can barely hear it. You, so it means that conversations when you've got two or even three guys in the truck, you can talk to each other without having to bellow over the top of a, um, a big rattly diesel. And have a look at that exhaust brake. This is a terrific combination of the exhaust brake plus the gearbox working together. It just washes the speed off, drops it back down through a gear, and away we go. Let's have a look around the cabin now. As we can see, the driving position is really good. There's plenty of headroom. I'm over 180 centimetres tall, 186 they tell me. Plenty of headroom. There's plenty of shoulder room. And most importantly for someone my size, there's plenty of thigh room. The seat, very supportive. Air suspension, which is terrific. Smooths out that ride when you're sitting on the steel spring suspension. Generally speaking, Everything just falls to hand. If you need it, you can reach it. You're not having to dive forwards to try and get a hold of everything. Nice big sun visors. Great for when the sun's in the wrong position. We had to use them earlier today. Fantastic. You can still have a nice big field of view, but you haven't got that big orange thing blinding you all the time. Up above, space to put your documents if you need to. Wallets, just perfect up there. Three seats across the cabin, perfect if you're taking your work crew out, but if there's only one or two of you in the truck, just a case of lifting the seat back, lay it down, and hey presto, we've got a work table. A couple of drink holders, oddman storage, open it up in here, guess what, just the right size for a work diary. Good on you UD, that's thinking. The remote control for the, for the tipping body could not be simpler. It's just a case of turning the power switch on, waiting until we get the green light. We can just see it flashing there on the remote control. That tells us we've got power. And then it's, we want to raise the, the body. We just push the, body, the button and away it goes. It's a remarkably quiet operation which, even with the engine running, means you're staying way under your decibel count and makes it perfect for working in residential areas. We're up inside the cab now. All you have to do, one flick of the rocker switch, the bolts have just moved across, and now we're ready to turn it into a tilt tray. So there we have it, UD's new MK6 automatic, a good honest work truck and with that fantastic tilt tip body on the back, this really opens up a lot of interesting new markets for them. Top marks to UD for having a go. You've been watching Truck TV, I'm Gary Worrell, see you next time.